Tell me why I'm sitting through this game. Tell me why I'm looking in the mirror. <laughs> Hello everybody, how are we all doing? It is the Freddas93 here and welcome to the beginning of yet another playthrough here on the channel. Now earlier for my birthday this year, I was actually gifted this game here. Tell me why? No, I couldn't tell you why I was gifted it. I know, we're a few seconds in the video and we're already starting with puns. Believe it or not, you should know this of me by now. But we are here, we are going to do another playthrough through on this channel. I know we've got so many unfinished playthroughs at the minute, but this is something I think I could possibly enjoy. So we need to get here and just delve into the world of Tell Me Why. Hey, kiddo. I need to ask you a few questions, okay? Can you tell me what happened tonight? I... I went to show her my haircut. She had a gun. She... Take your time. She freaked out. I... I... It's okay. No, it's not. It's not okay. My mom tried to kill me, so... So I stabbed her. I killed my mother. I was just not expecting to kick that up so fast, like, dang. Now we're in the residential centre about six months on, I think it was, or maybe it was nine months. My head just completely blocked the date, so we'll never know. I'm sure this was desert, residential centre it was like a rehabilitation centre, or... Aha, uh -huh. the silence up of alarm clocks, we all love those. I don't know if you really need to be set aside before you just want to it, but we're just uh, rolling with it. That is clean as well. We're clearly practicing to get back into the sun. Okay, first, I'm gonna find the keys to the old house. Then, 
I'm gonna drive to Fireweed, and I'm not going to freak out. Everything's fine. Of course it is. Now, are they in the draw? Oh, come on. Why do I still have this? Every time I look at it, it reminds me of how very single I am. Person Bobby, Cat, Caribbean Dreams, Sweet Prom 2012. Right, you can go back. So obviously you are not a set of house keys. Um I need to bring this with me to Juno. Yeah, you can yeah, that's a year problem to figure out how you're gonna do that. I should probably get rid of this. I mean I can stream it anytime I want. But it makes me happy just to look at the box. Yeah, well, you do you with that. That is a very noteworthy bit of information. Look like you just stared at the rocket and it's been like mm, okay. I have got to make solid plans to see the Geminids. I wonder if Tyler'd want to go. Yeah, you better do. Hey, you wanna freeze your ass off watching burning rocks fall through the sky? <laughs> yeah, I might need to work on my sales pitch. Yeah, I can't see oh, how. Right, see I how stashed them down work. here. So maybe you kept, maybe you kept the house keys in there. <laughs> so that's where you've been hiding. Evidently. There we are. We knew there would be somewhere. But who wants to bet those aren't even the real house keys? Alright. I think I'm ready to go now. Ah. Yes. You must be ready to go. You must be ready to go. Tell me why I'm sitting through this game. Tell me why I'm looking in the mirror. <laughs> you knew that was probably coming at some point. Uh, that's got to stay in the video, hasn't it? I haven't practiced since high school. I'm. Anyhow, we're completely ignoring, ignoring what we're supposed to be doing, and that is maybe going out. So awkward. Hmm. I know what you're thinking. A letter? Why? Why? Why are weird and formal? What's wrong with email? Well, I figured. Hey, bro. Just want. Just wanted to give my twin a shout before reuniting after ten years of swank. Juvie is more letter territory. Okay. It's ten years. I can't believe I'm about to leave this room for the last time. Definitely going okay. from kids I'm to- I'm pretty much done here. I just need to grab my goblin, and I'm off. Ah, uh, okay. A transgender man's guide to healthy masculinity. Okay. So there's definitely been a change- A change or two in this person here, perhaps? Anyhow, let's get moving. Wait, what's this letter? You know I'm bad at this, but just wanted to say you've been the best counselor, an at-risk yet redeemable youth. Ha <laughs> ha, good one. Thanks for putting up with me and helping me in more ways than you'll know. I'll try and make an account out outside Fireweed. Survival is rebellion. Thanks, man. Tyler. I just need to pack my goblin figurine. I wonder if Allison still has hers. We haven't even picked up the goblin figurine yet. Or well, you didn't even pack it? This box of junk treasures is now yours by the first law of finders keepers. Surely you would have had that already. Of this shit I gotta do. 
amazing. But now, I would think you'd like the thing. Surely. Bottom to have to leave this behind, but the old house would probably collapse if I blasted this inside. You reckon it would? I just need to pack my goblin figurine. I wonder if Allison still has hers. It's. Yeah, definitely a big change, isn't it? It's. supposed to do anything more with that box like it's not clip oh there it is hey little guy it You're was staring at me on the desk the whole time for heaven's sake right now take it like you should have had that with you in the first place yeah big silly silly oh, cool i guess i'm totally ready to go now i guess you probably are now let's go Hi, Tyler. Hi. First time we see each other in 10 years, and it's hi, Tyler. Oh, sorry, I... It's fine, Allison. Hi is a good place to start. God, it's good to see you. <sighs> Likewise. You have anything else you need to get? Nope, this is it. My last 10 years in a bag. Then we should get going. We just have time to make the morning ferry. You look good in that. Thanks. One of my mentees designed it. It's really good. Yeah, he's so incredibly talented. I got a couple of local coffee shops to hang his art. Tyler Ronan, shaping the leaders of tomorrow. Yep, we're screwed. <laughs> so, are you gonna miss anything about this place? Honestly, people. The other residents, my mentees, my counselor, Aaron. It took me a while to fit in, but once I did, it felt like home. They made me feel safe. Safe enough to be me. That's so great. I'm really happy for you. We planning to drive to Delos Crossing or push? You are welcome to walk. Nah, I'll take my chances. Need one last look or anything? Looked. Let's go. I am 100% not creative enough to make that stuff up. Oh, and just last week, they had to turn the ferry around because a bear was on board. No way. Someone heard a commotion in the back of a delivery truck, so they opened it up. And there was the bear, fat and happy on a literal mountain of empty chip bags. <laughs> you go where the food is. Oh, I can relate to that. So then what happened? I'm not sure. I think they couldn't get him to leave, so they tranked him. Oh, poor buddy. Shot in the ass just for getting the munchies. Yeah, well, you know what they say. Safety first in bear country. Yeah, but prevention is best. Common sense goes a long way in keeping them from getting shot. 
repair is fine, Tyler. For now. You hear they've been talking about loosening up regulations on trophy hunting again? Higher bag limits, inhumane ground traps, even bringing back hibernation hunting. What kind of asshole gets off on killing a sleeping animal? I'm not against hunting, but predators play a vital role in the health of our natural parks. What? Why are you smiling? I'm being serious. Oh, I can tell, Ranger Tyler. Not yet, but at least I got the school part out of the way. <sighs> I can't believe you've got a bachelor's already. While I boast a half-completed certificate in accounting from an online college that may have stolen my credit card number. You'll figure out what you want. You have time. How are you feeling? Like I'm about to drive straight into a whiteout and my fog lights are dead. What about you? Allison? Well, zoned out there for a second. Sorry. What's up? I'm sorry, I'm just trying to wrap my head around the fact that you're right here, standing beside me, on our way to Delos. You don't have to apologize. It's a lot. Why did we take the ferry instead of the coast road? Because I didn't want to be stuck in the car with you for an extra two hours. Ha ha. <laughs> we have to take the ferry. It's the only way to reach Delos from Fireweed. I see. Well, good. I don't think my stomach could have taken two more hours of how you handle curves. I'm sorry. Do you want to take over driving when we dock? <laughs> no. You're going to have to get back behind that wheel at some point, you know. Look, I put a fireweed van nose first in a ditch. Hey, at least you missed the porcupine. I'm guessing things haven't changed much. You mean in Delos? Still the capital of East Jesus nowhere. Can't wait to get out of here. Was it really that bad? Pretty much, but it could definitely have been worse. Like if you'd been tucked away in a center for troubled youth? Right. At least you had Michael. Yeah, I don't think I'd have survived high school without him. Bet you're gonna miss him when you move to Juno. How's he doing? Good, good, good. Uh, but I haven't seen him much outside of work lately. He's been busy with his dance and helping his clan organize a potlatch. Is that? Smoke coming out of Stonehouse? Guess someone finally bought that old shack. That, or the ghosts are cozying up by the fire. Think the new owners know it's totally haunted? I'm sure Tina did her best to keep them from figuring it out. At least until the paperwork was signed. Ugh. That house always gave me the creeps. Those windows are like huge gawking eyes. Uh, you think people talk about our house this way? Probably. That was just nice. Seemed to be a nice little bit of just like just chit chat. So, and, uh, oh, we're really going back there, huh? I'm quite ready to yeah. Stonehouse? I mean, we're going home. Yeah. Yeah, we are. Think the house will sell? No interested buyers yet. Turns out people don't line up to buy murder houses with no electricity. <laughs> At least it's got one hell of a view, unlike Juno. Hey, Juno has mountain views aplenty. It just also has people and fun. Are you still thinking you might be my roomie? I'm thinking about it. Hey, can I ask you a question? I don't know. You've been asking a lot of questions. What? I... Sorry. I guess I was a little overexcited. I'm just messing with you. Ask away. I was told... Um, I mean, after you, well, graduated, I guess and became a mentor three years ago. You still basically spent all your time at Fireweed, right? Pretty much. There were a few times I tried to go to these meetups for trans people in Juno, but something always came up. I probably should have put myself out there more, but it was better to be around in case the residents needed me. 
So you were free to come and go as you pleased? Yeah. Uh, why do you ask? Oh, nothing. Just being an overly invested sister. Curious how you spent your time. Allison? Yeah? Spit it out. Okay, you need to promise not to freak out. What is it? It's a gift. From Eddie. I know he's not your favorite person, but... I'm sorry, when you said Eddie, I thought you meant Chief Brown, as in the police officer who arrested me. Come on, Ty, don't- And your adopted father, the man who didn't let you visit me for seven years. The Fireweed Administration backed him up, Tyler. They thought it was best for both of us. Yeah, well, it wasn't. It's a peace offering, and you're the two most important people in my life. Please, for me. He can't buy my forgiveness with some cheap-ass trinket. It's a gift, Tyler. You know what gift-giving means in Clinket culture, and what it means to refuse one. I'll take it, but I'm not going to wear it. Really? Really. Just so we're clear, this was for you, not Chief Brown. You know, you could call him Eddie, or even Uncle. <laughs> Hard pass. Did you hear that? Whoa! No place like home. Yeah. Would it ruin the moment if I said I needed to call home? Uh, yes. Completely. Sorry. Go ahead and stop apologizing all the time. Okay, sorry. <sighs> Thanks. So, that uh, ride there was a lot longer than I thought it was. That so was weird being about back on the boat. Of recording time. Uh, we just saw something pretty majestic over there. We took the first steps have been taken. Yeah, we took the ring from yeah, uh, Uncle slash adopted father. More on the ferry right now. Father it appears. Uh -huh. Um I know, I know. From Yeah, our adopted uncle who transpires that uh they actually arrested us. Introduction making devil's club tea. There's no substitute protect that only home. Yes. Dance site, or dance performance, canoe for sale, bed and breakfast, and discover the pound of Alaska. Hey Allison, can we take the scenic route? Allison? Don't think she can hear you. Guess not. Good call, by the way. Yeah. Scenic route's longer, but the view's worth the time. Where are you headed? Uh, Delos Crossing? Same here. Of course you from around here? Born and bred. Ah, you don't say. I moved to Anchorage around your age. Delos okay. was mostly Alaskan natives then. Clay mm -hmm. kid, I uh, haven't been home in five years. Oh, so you owed your family a visit? I'll say. You may not know it yet, but your folks, they get old real fast. Right. 
I'm Alex, by the way. Alex Gershwin. No relation. Huh? To George Gershwin? Um... Gershwin, the pianist. Folks are always asking for related, so I try to hit it off the pass. Oh. Uh... What'd you say your name was? We didn't... I didn't. I'm Tyler. <laughs> yeah, we didn't. Tyler Ronan. I, uh... Ronan, huh? Ronan, as in the Ronans? Uh huh. So, who'd you uh, think it was? You're, I never knew those girls had a brother. We didn't. Uh, mm -hmm. I, uh. Nice talk. Yeah. Enjoy your time in town, Tyler. And that wasn't awkward at all. Yikes. Hey, I heard that. On that side. Where's my support check? My six pack. <laughs> okay, your phone call done now, then, is it? Let's join you again. Make the most hey, of the scenery. Fancy meeting you here. Yeah, fancy that. There's nothing like the open air. Hey, you send your application to Denali yet? Uh, not yet. I need way more experience. You're not applying to run the entire national park. They've got to have something entry level, right? Yeah, but I've done no internships, no volunteer work. No. They probably get hundreds of applicants, and I've got nothing Good to show. Come on, you don't know that. Doesn't hurt to try. Damn. I watched the cell footage you sent me, but seeing it for real is wild. Yeah. I'm just going to take a moment terrible. and appreciate the graphics in you this game. You could smell the well. smoke all the way over in Delos Crossing. Two years later, and they haven't cleaned it up at all? The company went under after, and surprise, no one else is eager to take it on. Someone died, right? Yeah. It was a crazy day. Yeah, it sounds it. I'm just going to um, admire the graphics on the game for the minute as well. Whoever, whoever was it was that um, designed this game, really great job. Really great job. Fantastic stuff. What else can we discover at this point? Well, what can we look at from this side? Probably just more of the scenery from like the mountains, the forest, cable car. And there. Looks like we're about to dock up uh, anyway, so. Uh, obviously, I suppose we're getting ready to uh, get back to the uh, possible call. I know what I know what to call it. Sunday after back to the car perhaps. Find out to get ready to get moving anyway. I hope we all put our belts on before we start moving. Yeah, that's what I took from that.
Wow. It's basically exactly like I remember it. Only faded. Like a Polaroid left on a windowsill. From the outside, it almost looks charming. Charm's not the problem. Structural integrity may be an issue. You think there's a chance whoever buys it will just tear it down? If someone buys it, they can do whatever they want with it. You wouldn't care at all? Would you? Sure. Everywhere I look, I see a piece of one of our adventures. Everywhere I look, I just see her. Allison, we could go grab a bite. Start this tomorrow? No. The only way to get this done is to do it. Do what exactly? And After you. Think you can tell what time of year this is going to be filmed out if you can start hearing my fan in the background. You can't really hear it in my streams, so shouldn't be able to hear it in the videos. Uh, did you smoke something before you left Fireweed? The door's right there. I know, I was just trying to look through the window. God damn it. Locked. Well, surely not. it's a good thing I remembered this. Surely a door, a door wouldn't be locked. You no, sure that's the right key? Yes. Maybe someone changed the lock. Who would change the lock on us? I don't know. We're screwed. You got a plan B? Yeah. We find another way in. I never knew a locked door that could keep the crafty goblins out. Yeah. We had a million ways in and out of this old house. Yeah. At least one of them's gotta work. Did we want to try the, like, the back door, perhaps? The crafty goblins. I haven't thought about them in forever. Or should I say, us? We almost spent more time as goblins than we did as kids. Oh, do you remember all the other characters? Remember how mad she'd get if we didn't use the compost? And she always knew when we were lying. Waste not, right, let's or try kiss the, back the door. planet goodbye. Open sesame. Let me guess. It's locked. Yup. Know any other secret passwords? Hmm. Honeydew? Nope. You didn't fancy running over with a set of keys that you had and try and get in that way then. And see if the keys were for the back door rather than the front door. It's no good. I can't open this one either. It's okay. We'll find another way in. That's obviously just locked from the inside. And it's obviously shut again as well. At least we don't have any use for this right now. Luckily. Remember the snowstorm in 2004? Marianne had us digging for hours. I remember she made it a game at least. That's right. We made yeah, tunnels to escape the ice troll. You gotta hand it to her. She can make us do anything if she doesn't seem like the greenest source of energy. Not like she had the money for solar panels. Right, so d tried all that. Shall we retry the window? The thing we looked at first. I could break a window. You know civilized people don't do that, right? Oh, so we're civilized now? <laughs> well, maybe not. But we are trying to sell this place, and broken windows aren't exactly amenities. Okay, so what exactly is your plan then? Not getting in this way. There are other ways inside. Come on. We basically have run around the outside of the house. We tried the At other least door. the shed's still standing. Yep. I don't want to think about what might be living inside it, though. Well, better alive than dead. Ugh, yes. Let's deal with it later. Plenty else to do first. Wait first. Hey, it's locked, all right. What was she doing out here that night? 
Come on, man. Stop thinking about that. Homemade cleaning products may be better for the planet, but they do not have the same shelf life. Oh, they probably Add don't. it to the shopping list. Right. Anyhow, I think for now I'm gonna leave this here, and we also like figure out our way into uh, the house again next time round. However, thank you so much for what watching the video. I hope you enjoyed it. Like and subscribe for more, and I'll see you pretty soon. Take care. Bye bye for now.